I was hoping it'd be like a pre rendered Oh, medicine! Oh, about fucking time! Too bad you couldn't give me more. Jesus Christ. Only two, huh? Hopefully there's more going throughout the castle. I guess I'm gonna have to fight more fucking people, too. And I was so certain I was about to be, like, done for the day. Oh, wait, pre-render cutscene. We're here. Would have been nice if I could actually save my game here. But no. If I quit, if I stop here, I have to restart all of that fucking shit. Ugh. Oh, your hair is black again? What? <laughs> is it just my imagination? Am I just seeing you how I want to see you? Or did you dye your hair? <laughs> I'm so confused. Was he never actually, like, white-haired and sick-eyed? Was that just how uh, Ryoma saw him? Uh-huh. Maybe that's why I'm seeing him how I remember him. Just because of the memories of this place. Yeah, I was cool with it. Oh wait, oh, I didn't know that. Oh, <laughs> whoops. <laughs> Nissan, you're so thick-headed and stupid, you dumb bitch. Goddamn, Takechi, why are you laying into me like that? That's true, I am an idiot. <laughs> To catch you, you fucking asshole. To catch you, you're like really turning out to be a big bummer. You're like not cool at all anymore. Maybe the real reason is still hidden, and he'll only tell me once I kill him. Why is your hair dark again? That's the most stupid fucking thing I've ever heard. You're an idiot. I thought you, you're saying I'm an idiot. No, you're a fucking idiot. I learned it from watching you. Damn. To catch you, you're like being a fucking asshole. You don't even feel bad. And your hair isn't white and you're, you don't have those bags under your eyes. I'm so confused. If it doesn't just like turn white at some point, I'm gonna have to Google and be like, what happened? Why was his hair white before? You couldn't have done this, like, a normal way. You had to throw the whole country into war. Now they think I'm a fucking dick. And it's all because of you. You made me seem like a dick to everybody. I mean, I've done pretty good about not really, like, killing people. The only people I've killed got killed by, like, other situations. Like, other people killing them or towers falling on them. Yeah. 
I'll have to Google that too if that's true. It makes a big difference to me, actually, because <laughs> one of those scenarios I'm dead. And I like really liked you, bro. Oh yeah, Yamazaki. It's been a second since we heard about who, who killed him, by the way. Was that also uh, fucking what's-his-face? I don't even remember his name. He's dead now. Takeda? Was it Takeda, or is that the guy that my friend that died? Hmm. Hold on, I'm just gonna Google at this point. Takeshi, why is his hair not white anymore? Ishin. Takeshi. White hair is one of the first things that shows up. Why did his hair turn white randomly? Exactly. He became old for one scene. Yeah, people are like, it was supposed to have a super aged him uh, since the last time Ryoma saw him. I have no idea why he turned young again, though. What the fuck? So the, it's, it's really not going to be fixed up, huh? Wow. I mean, like, maybe just the idea is supposed to be, like, one or the other is, like, implied. Maybe the old gaunt uh, Takechi was, like, the implied one, or maybe this is the implied one, but, like, one or the other is true. I personally think the white hair and like bags under the eyes was probably like the implied one that wasn't real. Just something that's like that's how Ryoma saw him at that moment because of everything. Because like why would he get that fucked up? I mean I guess he had been going through a lot but his hair was white. Oh god, now we have to fight. I was so hoping he was just gonna die of cancer. <laughs> Fuck. Great, now I have to fight you. I only have two healing items, and they're ones I've already been using, so it's not like I'm like, oh wow, this is the best healing item in the game. It is the best healing item in the game, and it's not gonna make a difference. God damn. It'd be nice if it would at least save me before this fight. Like a nice autosave or something. Damn. This is gonna be a sick fight, though. Yeah. <laughs> and your texture is loaded in just in time. Oh, maybe this is the implied one. Maybe he is, um, supposed to be white-haired, black bags under the eyes. I mean, this is a remake of the previous game. If that problem was, like, in the previous... Or problem, but if that... I guess... I don't know. If that imagery was the same in the first game... I think they could have cleared it up here. Like, I think they could have just shown that, like, he was still old-looking. Like, have the initial talk be with him with the dark hair and everything, and then go back to him being, like, old-looking. I don't know. Let's see how this fight goes. I'm... scared. I am concerned. Maybe it'll just all be quick-time events. Oh, man. So sick, though. Wow, I wish I could be in a sword fight. Oh, wait, all quick-time events. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> nope, we're in the game now. Well, at least I didn't... Oh, get out of this stupid, shitty sword style. <laughs> there we go. We got. Oh, he's, like, right in the heat, huh? Okay. Oh, and he's tanky. This new sword isn't making that much of a difference, huh? Fuck. Okay, well, this is gonna be fucking fun. All right. All right. Might have to, like, fucking super focus for this. I mean, honestly, I feel... Ooh, fuck me. I mean, I did get my ass beat just there, but I do feel like this is probably the type of fight that I could wind up doing with just two healing items eventually. Except for the fact that the game's not going to save me right here. So it's like, I'd have to go through all of it again just to fight him like this again. 
Uh, no, no, that's a bad move to get hit by. Yeah, fuck me. Okay. Oh, I can keep going. I can keep at it. Try again. I'm scared to look at the load save data option. Because I know I would just lose all my progress. Oh god, and it's still starting me in this stupid style. I feel like it's also punishing me. If I don't hit him consistently enough, uh, I'm going to lose like damage buffs. It's like it really does want me to be hyper aggressive. At least with this, uh, this style in particular. I mean, if I use my normal sword side, I wonder how effective guarding against him is. Oh, hey. What we got? We're tired. Come on, let's just sit down and take a drink, Bridger. Is that candle gonna, like, mysteriously go off? Oh, I'm just getting ready for a quick time. Ugh. Oh, ah, so cool. God damn, that'd suck if your finger was in the way of that. Ugh, that would hurt. This, this, is, this is dangerous. Uh, what did you say? Oh, wait, he just said Ryoma. Okay, never mind. <laughs> That'd be a dumb thing to be like, what'd you say, man? Oh, thank God we left the tiny closet room. Now we actually have space to work with. Damn, and he's throwing doors. This is so cool. God damn, what a cool fucking fight. It's a bad place. Yeah, I was going to say, it's a bad place for the sword to be. Holy shit. Oh, and the gun. Oh, he's got a gun. We are the same, you and I. So are we both Wild Dancer fighting now? Oh, wait, is that the thing? Like, should I have been fighting him in my normal sword style to begin with? Oh, yeah, he's totally Wild Dancer now. Wow, that's awful. I hate that. F f f f what are you doing? What, what is this? <laughs> what the hell? The fuck is this guy doing to me? <laughs> fucking Jesus. All right, well, I'm already in fucking one-shot range, so... Ooh, this ain't looking good. I wonder what his just gun style is gonna be like. Honestly, he's probably not gonna do just gun. Or if he does, it's gonna be like those twin guns again. I don't know. Okay, hold on. Can I just keep you in this corner like this for a bit, please? Okay, hold on. No! That is so unfair when they do it. <laughs> it's not cool when they do it. Only I can do it. Get that... Fucking heat cut quick time event. No, there we go. Hey, can I like start at the second phase? Second phase would be really cool to start at. Oh, temporarily switch easy. To Fuck yeah, no. I'm at this point, I don't care about playing on the the normal difficulty anymore. I am looking to just fucking win now. I want this game to be over with. Oh wow wow wow. Get out of here, you fucker. Fucking Fall to the ground so I can beat you up. Ah, uh, this again. Okay, it's not so bad. Because honestly, he can't do anything while I'm down like that. It's just inconvenient. The real problem is that then I have to wait. Oh, hey, I, oh, I almost avoided that in this entirety. What? Okay. I have to be careful with this moveset he has. It's so annoying. I like his color scheme for this, though. Well, hey, 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 let me get out of here. Come on. Come on, game. All right. Uh, no, not again. Oh, I kind of dodged it, weirdly enough. Hey, and that broke me out of the stunning portion of it. That's kind of nice. Ah, fucking in that shit. I wonder how good it is for me to do that. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. I want you to die. Okay. Huh. Get me a quick time event already, man. Okay, um, you know what? I'm low enough where this doesn't feel terrible to use. Ah, you are a hoe. Hate you. I hate you so much, brother. Oh, good job, Ryoma. <laughs> That'd be so embarrassing to have the epic battle with your brother just to miss a bullet like that. All right, here we go. <laughs> oh my god, no way. Running up the stairs with the bullets, shit's sick. Why didn't it give me a quick time there? Also, it looks like the bullet was already turning when I was about to hit it. Oh shit, he's throwing away the gun. Throw away the sword? Uh, I was gonna say, like, the yeah, this would be a perfect time to do, like, just melee fighting. No, he's sword. Okay. Ah, oh, man. Well, I'm not gonna change my fighting style. <laughs> yeah, fuck you, brother. Alright, hold on. I'm worried. I, who knows what kind of bullshit he's gonna pull. Alright, this is going so much. I'm so glad I did easy mode for this. Like, goddamn, I was not gonna fucking do this shit all over on normal again. I would've just lost. 
It would have been bad. I think there were times before. What the fuck? That was so cool. God damn, my brother's awesome. But uh, I think there were times before where I'd lose and it'd put me onto normal mode, and I'd be like, "Ew, no, fuck you, game. I'm not that bad. I mean, I am, but I'm gonna be mad about it." Now I'm just like, "No, no, that's okay. I am bad." Here, get sliced. Yeah, you can't stop this. I don't care if it takes all my heat. This is my most consistent big damage I can do. Suck if he had a phase two. <laughs> like asking for trouble saying shit like that. Okay, I just have to... Honestly, I think I'm fine at this point. No way he's gonna... I mean, he could do his heat action again, but it's not gonna kill me. Here we go. Here we go. Get fucked. The bullet was what did him. Actually, no. Stabbing the gun through his chest like that. That's what did him in. Oh, man, thank God. I was so fucking worried I was gonna have to, like, grind this fucking game. Unless there's a phase two or another boss fight. I don't fucking know. I just... I hope not. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, fuck you. I wish the cancer had taken you out. Alright, bro, you're gonna, like, stop being a villain now I beat you, right? You're gonna have to kill me. No, why do I have to kill you? Come on, man. Oh shit. Ryoma. <laughs> man. You gotta, you gotta finish the job, man. I don't wanna. I don't want to. <laughs> what if I just, like, let you do this now? Because I kind of like being Saito. It's kind of cool. Just like an everyday name. Oh. I was just saying it dramatically. You're ruining it, brother. Uh, Pops is dead. Sorry to rain on your parade, Ryoma. God, he's so fucking cool. Oh, so is he is just gonna not be a bastard at this point? That'd be nice. Good thing all we had to do was beat him up to make him understand he was wrong. <laughs> Yeah, you should've just did what I did and just be really fucking stubborn. Huh? Who are we talking about there? Who was using you? I don't remember that. Was it Glover? Right up until the point where I got stabbed. Friendship. <laughs> oh, that's about the same. Wow. That's a good life lesson, bud. Damn. Shibusawa's cool in this game compared to Yakuza Zero. This is really touching. Oh man. Now I do have two brothers. <laughs> Ryom is just like. You have to beat my other brother. What other brother? What do you mean? He's like, okay, to get in here. And a guy dressed in a fucking Harry that's like caked in old, stinky, crusty blood walks in with a crazy look in his one eye. <laughs> fucking Takeshi's just like, ooh, I don't know, I don't know. Aww. 
I'm glad I didn't have to kill you, bro. Ah, this is so fucking good. Makes up for all the bullshit I had to do to get to this point. <laughs> Is this the actual lore of Japan? Japan's cool. Why can't America have cool lore like this? I keep expecting someone's just like gonna like snipe one of them. And it's like, damn, we're not gonna get the happy ending of Ryoma like going back to Oreo. Or that like they'd kill Takechi and then Ryoma wouldn't get to uh live with him. Wait, to Ryoma? Oh, okay, he's just tired. <laughs> but be like, what the fuck? Did you get stabbed? Wow. A dawn on a new world. Fuck, and then Tink Takechi just pulls his gun out and shoots Ryoma in the head. That is such good lighting, my god. Yay, they're cool again. They're bros. Ooh, look at that. Look at that picture of a forest back there. Oh, look at his eyes. That's so good. Let's stop a war. It's gonna be hard to do. Everyone was so psyched to, to start a war. I'm surprised Glover didn't, like, just show up and shoot uh, to catch you in the head, being like, Hey, you didn't keep my part of the deal. It's a shame that Okita probably killed him. Yamauchi Yoda, who the fuck is that? <laughs> You'll find out in Like a Dragon Ishin 2. What? Who? I don't know what you're talking about. Then I find out I have 20 more hours of gameplay to do. <laughs> God damn. Shot through the head. Oh shit. It's okay, it's just a lung! I damn it, I knew this would happen, brother! God damn it! Who the hell are you? <laughs> He's got a mole in the center of his head. Isn't that the guy that uh, gets killed in the beginning of Yakuza 0? Y you saw this coming? Where have you been hiding all this time? Were you just waiting somewhere in the castle, listening in on this fight? What a fucking weirdo. No, uh, I'm Saito Hajime. Damn, too bad we don't have the medical technology to get that bullet out of his lung. Oh, he's a villain. Oh, he's evil laughing too. You can do that? Not the fucking British. God damn it, they're always doing this shit. Ew. God, imagine that universe. Actually, that universe is just Code Geass. So this was how it could have happened. <laughs> Guy, actually, no. He does look. He does have the part of like evil emperor, especially with that fucking mole in the center of his head. Oh well, that's cool. At least the classism will go away. Oh, 
God, imagine how fucking lame that would be. It's like you go on a trip to Japan and instead of like all the good foods they have, they sell like fucking fish and chips. Ugh. I hope Okida just comes up and decapitates this guy. He evil laughs a lot. <laughs> N no, I stood up. Idiot. You've like only just now shown up. Like, why would I? Care? This is such a fucking last minute reveal, god damn. It's okay, I've blocked bullets before. Surely this won't kill me. Ryoma, you can't block a bullet. I do it all the time. Ah, you distracted me, bro. Wait, is Ryoma actually gonna die? It'll be so fucking sad. I will not need you. Yeah. Oh no, Ryoma! No! Damn, he's so fucking cool though. <laughs> oh man, no. I don't want it to end like this. Wanted him to hang out with Oreo. Shit, he's got the power of love on his side. I mean, this guy could just shoot him again. Oh shit! Yeah! Oh shit. So glad. Yeah! I'm so glad you made it, brother. Oh, where'd your gun go? Oh, fucking no. Ah, okay. oh, this is great. Okay. Ah, oh, it's so cool to have a, a squad of homies. And Hijikata, too. Damn, they don't really look all that worse for wear. Oh. Don't say that. I don't want any of you guys to die. What? <laughs> you just shot me. Why would I do that? Is this going to be the one person that Ryoma actually kills? Ryoma, don't listen to him. Why would I? I don't like this guy. He's, he's standing up pretty well for all those bullets in him now. Oh shit. Oh, it's playing the intro music. Ah, oh, they're all so fucking cool. I don't think it's gonna matter. You didn't show up till the end of the game, why would it fucking matter? Oh, it's so fucking cool. お前でも俺でもね。ここにいる誰でもね。は、話にならない。何言うちょうなことを言っているんだ。今目の前にイギリスの艦隊が迫っているんだぞ。奴らとまともに戦って勝てるとでも思っているのか。さあな。I mean, I did just take out a whole fucking like army. And a guy who was really good with a sword. My brother. Classes don't exist anymore, you racist. Huh? I'll cut that too. 
お前は分かっちゃいない負けるのは目に見えているんだぞいや<笑>なあたとえ今負けたとしても日本は何度でも勝ち上がるさ<笑> Especially for World War II <laughs> But then after that we'll fall down again but then we'll rise up again but like with anime In cool games like Yakuza Zero, it just does like a fucking unnecessary plug. I love how also Takechi's just in the background right now, bleeding out, listening to this, like, ah, bro, you're so cool. The speech isn't taking too long at all. I love how this cutscene, this final cutscene, is so, like, loaded up with this one guy that I've never seen until now. All I, I've seen all I needed to see of him is that he's just a piece of shit. I just, I don't know. It, he really just feels like he is, like, the final villain that came out of nowhere, but just, like, a piece of shit kind of villain. Not even, like, a scary villain. I mean, he's scary in how petty he is. Maybe not petty, but I don't know, he's, he's petty. He's definitely petty. But man... I, I feel like they could have shown him a bit earlier. I don't know, just in some of those cutscenes involving, like, Takechi. But then again, I guess there's all supposed to be a secret all this time that Takechi was still alive. But not my sisters. Oh, damn. Why did that clip the audio? <laughs> damn. Damn. So is that... Yeah. Wow. Holy shit. Takaya Kuroda, you clipped your microphone, but goddamn, was that good. Wow. We did it. I beat the fucking game. <sighs> it's so... It's so weird with Yakuza and, I guess, like, a dragon. Where it's like, it's such a great fucking story, and then I get so frustrated with the actual gameplay. But then it makes up for it with all the cool shit. Honestly, I think if I was just better at games, it wouldn't be so bad. I also think if I took the time to actually do, uh, like, side stuff and actually get money and upgrade my weapons and armor and shit. Probably wouldn't be so bad. This is like actually a one-for-one -one copy of what I said at the end of Yakuza 0, I bet. They're all like as solid as this. I feel like the writing is just so good. I already talked before about how like they made something as fucking boring as real estate into an interesting plot point. Yeah, fuck. Solid game. I loved it. Uh, there's some, I guess, some combat stuff that I didn't like so much, but you know, that's just getting shot in the back and then... On, okay, no, that is actually something I would uh, say I dislike greatly. How often they shot me and stunned my ass. But, you know, maybe there's a technique I could have used to fucking prevent that. Uh, let's see. Do we have anything? Oh. Oh, these aren't the skippable kind of credits. Okay. Well, I guess I'll chill here and just see if there's an after credit scene. I mean, it seems like we've got a good ending as far as, like, Ryoma's concerned. He's still alive. He should be able to make it back to Oreo eventually, right? Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's fine. Yeah. Totally not dead or anything. Oh, God. That would suck. I was so worried that, like, he was just gonna up and die. And that it'd be, like, for the actual, um, <laughs> the actual lore. Although, I am curious. I want to see. They keep, I think the whole idea is that, like, this game, I mean, definitely it's not actually, like, true to whatever uh, happened. Because uh, I'm pretty, like, 
I, that's probably why they they made a point of being like, yeah, Sakamoto Ryoma died at the hotel. The hotel I keep calling it the hotel at Omiya, because um, I think that's probably what pro- uh, like actually happened. And for the sake of like the story of this game, they took advantage of it to be like, but actually, what if? I think so. Whatever happened in actual history, I. Th- I think, yeah, they basically all got wiped out here. I'm, <laughs> I'm basing this off of what I know from Golden Kamui, which that's another thing that definitely does not follow true with history, because that's like Hijikata gets arrested around this time uh, in Hijika- uh, in uh, Golden Kamui, and then, yeah, he tries to retake over Japan or whatever. So, yeah, I don't know. They probably just all died around this time. I don't think there was ever an actual invasion of Tosa. I wonder if there's like a website I could look at that's like... It would compare this game to actual history. Let me just like... Like a dragon, Ishin, history... Oh, historical accuracy. Perfect. Let's see. Ishin is a slower historical drama. Its greatest strength and weakness is authenticity. Despite layers of absurdity and creative license, protagonist Sakamoto Ryoma is a real person. Many events in the game are based off of real historical accounts. But how much of it? It's loosely accurate. Let's check Reddit. Reddit will have the answer. Let's see. Uh, it's loose. People are just saying, like, loosely accurate. Story histories... Shinsengumi is real. The Big Bad was real. Ija Naika real. I, I don't know what the Ija Naika, Ija Naika was. What's that one of the songs? I don't remember. Tenen Rishin Ryu is a real sword style. Wow, that was used by the real Shinsengumi. They take a long way around to avoid calling the U.S. an enemy or naming us as the ones behind the black ships. I think it's good to get caught up in the, avoid getting caught up in political nonsense. Okay. Uh oh god. <laughs> Every comment in this Reddit post was, like, super small and easy to digest, and then I just came across an entire fucking paragraph. Like, it is a wall of text. Uh, so Saito was the third captain. Was Saito actually, like, Ryoma? Oh, no, it's saying they're two completely different individuals. Okay, so that's probably where, that's where they took the old liberty of, like, to Sakamoto Ryomas, oh my god. It's the whole thing of like, yeah, he's pretending to be Saito Hajime. Yeah. So that wasn't real. What else? They were great swordsmen. Kiryu. Oh, no, not Kiryu. That's probably talking about Okita. It's a very gifted swordsman. It's accurate. <laughs> Before playing this game, my knowledge of Shinsen Gumi came from Gintama. Yep. <laughs> That's... That's pretty accurate. That's how I am. Okay, so, yeah, more or less, this game is very, <laughs> very historically accurate. But, yeah. So, Hi- Saito Hajime and Ryoma, definitely different people. Oh, God. That was something I was kind of curious about. It's like, I wonder if they just uncovered, like, a journal at one point that was like, yeah, this is what actually happened. I was like, oh, shit. Man. I just, so I, I guess, I... I want to say Hichikata, Soji, Shimpachi, and... Uh, oh, no, that was it. That's the only three there. I guess they probably didn't make it to that point. Because I don't think there was ever a raid on, like, Kochi Castle. I think that was probably something they just added in for this story. Which was cool. Just fucking goddamn rough. I'm glad I had the option to switch it on to easy. I was so certain, like, if I, if I couldn't have beaten that... And I had to reload. I was fucked. Two years later, Tokyo. Oh, oh, hey, and it's your boy. Oh, this is like super realism cutscene. Damn. Oh, is this Hijikata? Oh, oh, it's Katsura. This is so good looking. Damn, they just took a picture of someone's backyard. That's so cool. Ah, oh, present domestic affairs. Everyone's wearing suits now, too. Oh, yeah. Maybe that's... I should have looked up uh, Takechi lore. From behind the scenes. That probably means they took uh, liberty with that. Oh, this is the Meiji Restoration. Okay. Wait, Yamauchi. 
Yamauchi Yodo. Who the fuck was that again? Oh, okay, so no, 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 that is, um, Takechi. Damn. So many names. I mean, I'm only assuming that guy is, um, Takechi because of the haircut, the shaved head, and everything. <laughs> you alcoholic. That looks so fucking realistic, goddamn. And why doesn't he look old here? What about Ryoma? I want to know about his happy ending with Oreo. Oh, is this him? Uh, it's like Hijikata, I think. So are they saying that he lived in this scenario? That's not Hijikata, doesn't sound like him. Unless he became like a grumpy writer. Wait, is this that stupid writer? Was he actually important? No way, I thought he was just there as a side quest. Wait, that's not Nakaoka, is it? Oh. Hmm. Like the Saito Hajime. Bro, you need some natural light. You're gonna die. Sakamoto Ryoma by Sakazaki Shinron. Yeah, go out and walk around. Damn, I need to listen to my own advice. I need to walk around on a nice day. It is Nakaoka, right? I'm so bad with faces. Oreo and Ryoma? Wait, they can't get married? Why? <laughs> Why can't they get married? Don't they believe in Christ? <laughs> God. Wow, yep, that's a beautiful sky, alright. Just a big old empty blue sky. Oh, there he is, Ryoma. Oh, wow, they fucking went out there. And she's hiking around in like goddamn kimono like that? She has no leg movement. How are you gonna hike like that? I'm so glad he survived. Whoa. Yay. What a weird thing to just say. <laughs> I, if I were Oreo, I'd look at him like, uh, laugh a little bit, like, it's kind of a weird thing. He just said, it's like, stop. Don't make fun of me. I was trying to be really poignant. All right, now what? Finn. Wow, we did it. It was the same people that made Sonic the Hedgehog. <sighs> Difficulty normal. Not totally, though. Wow, I only had continued seven times that's a surprise uh completion total was only 12 percent and i played for technically a whole day wow hooey damn yeah that uh i did not even scratch the surface of the game that's crazy that like the main game is only like a, probably around 10 percent that is whack less than 10 percent i uh, would imagine because I did a fair number of side quests. Holy shit. Ooh. Whoa. Wait a minute. That's a lot of money. Can I New Game Plus and buy that girl's house now? New modes have been added to the main menu. Bakumatsu. Bak Bakumatsu. Bakumatsu. No, wait. What? I didn't hit A. I was reading that. Son of a bitch. Okay. Whatever. Let's save this here. The end. Does that mean... If I just, like play from that okay well whatever i guess we're back in the main menu um i don't know i could i don't know like i said i'm really bad at replaying uh games that i've beaten before so i don't know when i'd ever like actually come back around to this it would be cool to though it's just for so long it's like rpgs mainly i can never go back and replay rpgs but yeah, on that note, I am glad I beat this game. Now I am done with another series, and I'm going to take a break for a bit. So yeah, on that note, this has been a Gator Sniper playthrough. Uh, see you guys in the next one. Later, everybody.